there is something we need It's a leap of faith A step away from the comfort zone And be a little brave So take a look around you How far can you see? How far do you think you can run? Standing on your own knees It's a beautiful world out there just don't pass on the dead If you have the will and a moment to spare It's a beautiful world out there It's a beautiful world Morning guys Morning Sunday morning 1st of August Wow, where's the year going? Can't believe it um, We just outside Market Bosworth At this uh, train track Stroke, st stroke station um, it's closed by the looks of it though we've, we've heard the train there must be a train running somewhere it's on the bridge here at the moment traffic going by but there's a canal so we parked just down by the uh, train uh, works where the train train uh, garage is just down the, the way just the back of there so uh, we had a good night last night we were Chinese yeah. Delivered to the van. To the camp. Yeah. yeah, so they came to the gates. We just picked it up. A nice beef curry Chinese, which is lovely, wasn't it? Mm -hmm. um, just had a chill watching telly. Sat outside for hours. You'll probably see some time lapse on the um, either well at the end of this probably. <laughs> so yeah, we did some time lapse just to try both cameras out. The little uh, Pocket Two time lapse and this on time lapse. Thought we'd just see where how it, uh, the Pocket Two works more than anything. So yeah, hope you like that in a bit. And uh, yeah, we're just going to uh, have a look here in this uh, canal here, just down the side here in a second. And then uh, we'll be probably heading back towards home. So let's go and have a quick wander down towards the canal. Catch you in a minute. We can hear it in the distance if we can't see it. I think, guys, this is a nice little park up. No. Why? Market Bosworth train station. Nobody about. It's closed at the moment. Access in easy. It's in a river, but that doesn't matter. <laughs> I think it'll be all right for the night. See you later. Shackleston Station. We think. We've been to one place already and it wasn't where you saw us before. So we'll have a quick look down here. You see the railway line? I know that the um, canal there outside. So, guys, we'll have a look. We'll go under this bridge and we'll have a look. Half a mile. Half a mile down the track. Train's running today. We heard it earlier, obviously off camera. We heard it choo chewing away. <laughs> so we'll catch you down by the station. So we're in an old train station goods yard by the looks of it. These old railway carriages. It's obviously open to the public this bit where we are now. Yeah, it's a, it's a goods yard, train station yard where they store the old trains and carriages and tractors and cranes and everything by the looks of it. Old uh, Jones cranes and Coles cranes. Some diesel locos as well by the looks of it, as well as steamers. Something a bit different for you guys, <laughs> rather than van life, yeah. train life. Yeah. Hey, that'd be a good home, wouldn't it? Get all kitted out, converted in. Couldn't go far in it, like, could you? Like, put... No. <laughs> but be one hell of a thing if you got somewhere in a field or somewhere on old your land or whatever. Imagine converting that into a living home, living space. 
crazy with it. There's an idea for you. Bit of track on the ground. There's your own. <laughs> Diesel locos. It's obviously goes on the track for repairs. Kiss, come on. D6508 for you train spotters. You might want that for your collection. Wow. Little shunter. Electric as well, while they're looking at the top of that. Another diesel loco. Spotters again, 37906. And the steamers are down there. Right, catch you on the station. Might just catch it before it goes. Just about to steam up and go, it looks of it. Just missed it just going. <laughs> oh well guys, just missed it, never mind. Tea rooms on. Oh. Spotted the tea room. Yeah, bingo. Right, catching a bit. Tea calls. Just missed that one. I was just saying to the guys. Just missed it. We missed it earlier, didn't we? When we were down by the canal. There'll be another one. Star, look. If there's only one running, I don't know, because this is the battlefield line. Obviously this area is well known for the battlefields. The place where we were stopping last night, they said there was a King Georgia, I don't know, whatever. It was um, to look it up really. It was where it stayed and then something. Kiss! We'll go straight through here. The old train. Yeah. Uh, yeah, Shenton. Right, let's come see what's what. Um, pound, that's alright, yeah, yeah. By right, catching a bit, gotta pay a pound, that's okay. We're on the platform now. Shackles, was it Shackleston? Shackleston? Got our tickets as well, look, guys. Platform tickets, pound each. Obviously, it goes to good causes for keeping it running. Toilets, a little bit of a museum, a little tea room, which we'll have a look at in a minute. Bit of old memorial sort of little shop over the other side on platform two. The old bridge over the top. Some sort of shop as well, is it? Oh yeah. The viewing area. Water refilling. And that's where we are. Right. Carriages here. Right, to the viewing point. Let's have a quick look. The old coal on the lines, look, the old 
coal from the steam trains where they've been filling up. Obviously the water there. An old track changing of the tracks of the lines. Pull them and that changes. Signalman's box up there, he's just come walking down just. There's very much coal underneath this, there's stone and coal. You say viewing point, I don't know what's up here, I'll have a quick look. All sheds. Obviously repair sheds or whatever or storage shed. We'll have a look, because he said, didn't we? As we carry on further up, just cut the camera for a couple of seconds then, because it was just a grassy pathway at the moment. And this is what they must class as the viewing point. <laughs> Some trains, carriages down there obviously, a bit of a work yard. Must be just a viewing point here, look where you watch a train come in and out. Some electric uh, trains there by the looks of it. Not electric, uh, diesel, maybe a diesel engine train that. Hastings line. British Rail sign one, obviously that other one. Can't quite see what's on the front of it. I think it says Birmingham on the front. You can't probably see. Yeah, it says Birmingham on the front of that one on the front uh, window thing. It tells you where it's going. What's this other one got on it? Litchfield, I think that is. Litchfield City. So yeah, there's the signalman's uh, signal signalman's uh, hut. Right, we'll carry on back down. Catch you in a minute. Well, it's like stepping back in time, sitting on this old railway platform, and it's steam platform. Bit of signs at the back here. Where have you got um, signs like that and the station buffet. No cigarettes, drink, camp, no one's tea. But the phone, they're all old um, signs of the era. Over, over there, you got obviously again tobacco, cigarettes, Will Chapman's. Maybe cut, which is cigarettes again. Yeah, it's really stepping back in time, isn't it? All this stuff. Cafe area is even more stepping back in time. Look at it. Back in the 40s and 50s, were you? Saying like stepping back in time in here, isn't it? <laughs> Sorry. The old signs. Have a walk over the other side of the platform in a bit. Go and see Postman's Pat, little truck over there. <laughs> You'll see inside there and where the cafe area is. That's really like stepping back. 
Right. Right. Wait for the train to come. Bye. Guys, here comes the train. Coming in backwards. <laughs> goes then guys with the carriages behind one two three four five carriages by the looks of it these old lights or lamps Forget about the old signs, got all the signs in here. Signs are worth some money on the line, aren't they? All the old signs in the place. Oh. You waiting for the train? Loads of people on it. <laughs> Steam. Steamy down there, isn't it?
Suitcase at all. You're right, we're just having a look. You're right to go and have a look through? Yeah. Yes, so. thank you. Yeah. Cheers, thank you. That's a mystery. And here's some old telephones and the old workings. All the hats. Signal hats and train driver hats. Well, line phones old lamp look be an old gas lamp type or a paraffin of the likes stepping back in time in here for good sure Brilliant how they keep these going, these places. All oh, signal controls. It's got charm on this, I think. The fact that it is all friendly, isn't it? It's, oh, I suppose it is, yeah. I mean, it's. Yeah. Um, yeah. Look at these. Some of these ends are properly laid out, aren't they? You know, yeah. This, this is the fascination to me. Really. Yeah. Everything is. Every nook and cranny is taken, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. 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 It's amazing, you know, the, the stuff that's. Um, we collected. Yeah. <laughs> A lovely museum that is, eh? Must be the guy himself, perhaps in there. John McQueen's. Well, guys, that was interesting, especially that uh, old little museum crammed full of memorabilia history, and obviously run by the guy that was in there, the old guy that was in there um, talking to the other one. Um, you know, really could take your hat off to him making that museum for us all to see. So if you're ever in this area, um, def yeah, Market Bosworth, Shackleton was it? The mm -hmm. Shackleton line. Um, old steam uh, train runs from here. About 40 minutes each way, wasn't it? Something like that. No, 40 minutes return it was, wasn't it? Yeah. We didn't go on it. We obviously got here too late. It was just gone, but 
so yeah definitely worth coming and having a look especially for definitely. that that museum in there was amazing as you could see you know all the old signalmen's uh the the levers for the signals the hats the train drivers hats the, all the old um plaques with old trains and different things the old lanterns the lights wow must have took some time to gather all that so yeah i think that's us now we're just gonna head back to the to the van then head back for home Hi. being sunday the first of august now yeah. we had a good few days on we wednesday we headed off out down to uh, hope hope valley yeah um then went into castleton Walk walked down yeah. into castle to castleton uh met up with the uh, Pixie and not impressed Jeff. Yeah, had a lovely cup of coffee, <laughs> yeah, from, which then led to a meal, which then led to a late night. <laughs> uh, from uh, obviously always van adventure, check them out, uh, and Pixies as well. Yeah, um, got her own uh, her own pixie spirit. pixie spirit. That's it. So yeah, we've had a good time. Then that walk back across the field. They said there's a sure cut. They said not in the dark. <laughs> not in the, the dark. All we had was sheep looking at us going. What are you doing? <laughs> Get off my field. <laughs> so, but we got back in the end. It was it was yeah. light when we started, but it was dark but in the end. Bit, bit, I, I wish I'd have recorded that because your face. I was fuming. <laughs> <laughs> never mind, never mind. Never got the camera turned, have we? I think the battery had gone or something. But yeah, so yeah, then obviously the um, down to that canal side park up, which was <laughs> rip off wasn't it really uh, oh, horrible. But anyway then uh, obviously there's a park up the other side of the road for free yeah well for, well brit free stops. for a brit stop free for us and then obviously yesterday into market bosworth here and down into town walking around lovely campsite that is that adds off to that campsite we we're in last night yeah it was lovely i think it was 30 pitches 40 pitches definitely come again yeah very very worthwhile and rounding up today at the, the steam train train station here so yeah guys we'll catch you next week um friday onwards friday onwards we're off to the lakes so keep looking watch our shenanigans watch out for our shenanigans and don't forget to press that button and subscribe so till next time bye for, bye now. for now